I'm clearly in the Christmas spirit. We are making barbecue. Barbecue is a staple in most Filipino households. It's not hard to make and you can make it in a big volume, which makes it the perfect dish for a large amount of people. And we are back, as we were saying, 12 recipes to help you through the holidays, to get you going quickly, get you eating even faster. Today we're making a Filipino style chicken barbecue. Well, it's not really barbecue because we're not barbecuing it. We're actually putting it in the oven. But the effect is just the same. The flavor developed is just beautiful. Lots of different people have different variations and different ways of making chicken barbecue. I've seen Sprite being used. I've seen banana ketchup being used. So everyone has their own style. I'm gonna show you how to do mine really quickly. It's a very simple process, quick marinade, minimum of four hours up to overnight, up to two days in the fridge and then you just bake it um, and it's delicious and sticky and beautiful and kind of like dark and gooey. Uh, so we're gonna start really simply. So I've got my little marinating tub here. Four tablespoons of brown sugar and these are big heap tablespoons. One massive tablespoon or two tablespoons rather of tomato paste. Some pineapple juice from the can. It actually helps break down the meat a little bit, giving you a tender meat. So I learned this trip when I saw one person making beef tapa and they use pineapple juice there and makes the meat much more tender. Finally, we've got some lemons. You don't need to strain this. Red chili peppers for people who like spice, just break it up. Finally, some garlic. And then obviously soy sauce and lots of it. Dilute the sugar in the sauce. Make sure your tomato paste is kind of well incorporated as well. All we need to do now is place our chicken inside. So I've got a mix of thighs and drumsticks here. Perfect. Fridge for four hours. Four hours later and a quick change, we're good to go. Our chicken is fully marinated. You'll see that the color has become slightly more brown, which means that the skin and the meat has absorbed all that flavor. All we're gonna do now is take this liquid and put it in a pan, because this is what we're gonna use to base and I'm just gonna cook it down a little bit so that it actually does get slightly more thick and becomes more of a barbecue sauce, less of a marinade because there's sugars in there, remember, so it will help thicken everything. That is good to go. Lay the chicken on a rack here, and we're gonna put this straight into the oven. You'll see that the sauce will thicken up really quickly. That comes off the fire. And then what we're gonna do is use that as basting liquid. But for the first 25 minutes, we're just gonna let the chicken stay in there. It doesn't really matter what side it goes up or not. I did end up putting it all skin up, so perfect. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna dip this into the sauce. It's just an easier way to baste things. Put it back on there and do the same thing for all of it. This goes back into the oven for seven minutes and then we do this one more time. All right, look at how perfectly golden and crispy these are. Well, not crispy, but golden and brown. One last dip, and then I think these look almost ready, so I'd say maybe five more minutes only after this. If the juices run like that, they run pretty clear, that means it's pretty much almost ready. For this last stretch here, I'm gonna crank up the heat to 425, just to get it even kind of like crispier and gnarlier. All right! That's the color we want. Let's plate this bad boy up. There's not much more to do but to try it. Mmm. That flavor, it's crazy. Look at that skin. Aside from the sugar in here, it's a pretty healthy recipe because it's baked, right? Mmm, perfectly cooked. Definitely a winner, and definitely should be on your Christmas table. Really easy to do. Marinate, bake, forget about it, pill it out, and then people can enjoy it right away. I hope you guys like that. Um, I can't talk anymore. It's so good. I hope you guys enjoy that video. Please make sure to catch all the previous videos and all the upcoming videos to make your Christmas perfect. Peace out.